Hey guys, I'm myself here. Welcome back to the channel. And today I wanted to talk about a feature within iOS 15 that Apple just really didn't even mention on their keynote when presenting iOS 15. They didn't talk about it at all. And I think it's one of the coolest features in iOS 15. And I wanted to share the details with you guys. Now this feature is called prepare for new iPhone. And this feature, as it implies, it allows you to prepare your previous device to be sold, trade, or given away to someone else. It is seamless. It is a really cool feature within iOS 15. I think you guys might want to know about. So without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at the new iOS 15 feature, prepare for new iPhone. Now there's two ways you can enable this feature. The first way is by simply going into settings, general, scrolling all the way to the bottom, and then going to reset. And right here, you find the new feature, prepare for new iPhone. Once you click into this, it'll show you a step-by-step -step on what you have to do in order to prepare for the new iPhone or the next iPhone that you want to use. Right here, click get started. And then it's gonna show you all the apps that have not been backed up to the cloud in case you wanna do that before you proceed. And once you click your option, you right here get a breakdown of everything you will do in order to get this device ready to be, as I mentioned, trade, sold, or given away to someone else. Now, this process is showing up on this particular section here for me on some devices, but it's not showing up on others. So it's this option right here. And once you click into this option in settings, once you go through that process of backing up your data, you see here that you now get a breakdown of everything that will be removed from this device when you set it up in order to be sold trade or given away so you have the apps and app data you have the apple id and then you have the option to go into the find my and remove it from the find my network from your account that way the next person does not encounter any issues now the other way is to have another device right when you first open up your new iphone and you want to set it up with the one that you currently have you go through the setup process here as per usual you have your newer device and your old device next to each other the ones that you want to go ahead and transfer the data to and once the process is completed you'll get greeted of course with the main uh, prompt here the main card that says enjoy your new iphone all the data has been sent over to the other device of course and then right here uh, when you're ready come back to get this iPhone ready to be trade in, sold, or given away. And then you can click what's next for this iPhone, and then you'll get prompted to go through the setup process as well. So there's two ways to enable this manually, and of course, using the initial setup process for iOS devices when you first buy another device, as just demonstrated here. I think it's a really cool feature. It helps clean your device, securely erase your device, and prepare it for the next person. And I think Apple didn't really mention this one, but I think you guys would find this one helpful. And there you guys have it. That about brings it into this very quick video, but this really cool feature in iOS 15, prepare for a new iPhone. Thank you for watching this quick one, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.